Hi guys, so a while ago we did a video with the YouTubers that um, uh, everyone here at MyCritic uh, watches. Some of the channels were suggested by you, some of the channels were suggested by my colleagues, some of them uh, were just uh, found, you know, but uh, in the comments you pointed out even more amazing channels. So let's dive right in and today let's take a look at what uh, Microsoft YouTubers are you guys watching? Let's go! So, the first in line is the Fixit Gal and this channel focuses on teardowns. They are opening up the devices, you will get to see all the all the inner workings of the switches and routers and um, really crafty crafty channel with uh, lots of special knowledge like it isn't like super polished in terms of production like you won't see you know, like graphics moving around and uh, green screens and whatever. But that's not the point. Um, this channel is sharing like special, special engineering and um, uh, knowledge targeted at um, internet service providers and also uh, I think even, even some distributors would uh, find this useful because, uh, well, whenever Surf the Home guys are opening up the devices I hear from all sorts of people how useful it is to see like uh, a detailed teardown so um, not a lot of channels are doing this so besides serve the home i think this is the best channel if you want to know the insides of the, the hardware yeah okay and also the voice with this very very pronounced a bit high-pitched voice that is so easy to pick up even if you are listening on the phone something like that such a pleasant voice, so check it out. Number two, um, some of you mentioned in the comments uh, that uh, there's a distributor in South Africa, a Scoop, that are doing excellent, beautiful, gorgeous, studio-grade uh, microstick videos, tutorials, all sorts of stuff. And uh, indeed, the production is mwah, just excellent. Uh, a lot of things they are doing better than us. Uh, old videos are easy to follow and they know what they are doing uh, and judging from the comments mm, there is a, a very strong community presence they respond to ideas they interact um, the community is also like um, a perfect example of Microsoft community people are, are really sharing the knowledge so scoop from South Africa excellent work Okay, moving on. Next channel you guys suggested, just any tech. So this is a channel that you can clearly see uh, puts in the work. The knowledge is good. The knowledge is there. Um, but the, this style of presentation, I agree, it, it might not work for everyone, especially for um, younger people. But um, but still, I, I encourage you to look past the the form you know and look at the content because the knowledge is good uh, also i have a small suggestion if you are watching this just any tech um, I, I see that you used to do voiceovers and they had more views now when you do more on-screen text the views are dropping so i know that a lot of people have like limitations on how much they can use their voice or sometimes we are um, self-conscious about the voice, the accents, whatever. So recently, um, some of uh, my friends who work in uh, video production, they showed me a great life hack. How can you get a, a pretty good AI voice? Just get one of the paid um, AIs, like uh, ChatGPT, for example, and they have a voice chat a feature, and this feature is getting better and better every day. And you can actually direct it as a director, I'm like uh, on on uh, on a set of a movie or whatever. So you tell uh, the AI what to say, but you can also tell him what kind of emotions, what kind of intonation um, it should use. If you tell him to be like more angry or ironic, uh, this uh, voice chat thing is now able to produce like uh, pretty realistic um, emotions. So it's not this generic AI voice, you can work with it. So I would suggest try maybe adding the voiceovers once again. But um, anyway, really good knowledge, uh, good tutorials, 
So let's all uh, give uh, Just Any Tech the push uh, they need to make more content. Next up is the Technically Unsure. Of course, it's not a pure Microtech channel, but uh, the Microtech content is there. And uh, the latest video that you should definitely see is the Rose Data Server unboxing. And um, really, really in depth, he's telling about the use cases, the specs, showing the again the, the inner workings, and um, you can really see that um, this is a hard working and um, passionate channel, uh, very modern, um, good production quality, but also very authentic. Like it doesn't feel fake or overproduced or or like I don't know. Uh, it, it really speaks to you on a human level, so technically unsure, well, I am sure that you should uh, check out that channel. Okay, next up, uh, one, one, one other channel that you guys said that we forgot to include is, uh, is a guy called Mahir Hadid from the MAICT YouTube channel. And this is an interesting addition uh, because this is a paid channel in a way. He has some Microtech tutorials for free, but uh, basically this channel wants you to subscribe and to pay a little bit to unlock the tutorials, but um, he's a real teacher, a uh, real Microtech instructor uh, with uh, knowledge that um, might be worth paying for. Uh, I know that we mainly focus on sharing the knowledge for free, but then again, there's so many uh, Microtech professionals who uh, rely on um, on their knowledge to bring them uh, the bread to put on the table so so we are definitely not against promoting paid content as well so if you are a microstick um, instructor trainer if you do your own content uh, consider also making like free content and paid content and uh, we are always here to uh, feature it to help you with some advice um, so yeah, get in touch, show us your paid content as well, why not? Um, but for now, uh, this, is, uh, this is the example. Now, of course, Microtech is a global community. It would be weird if I only focused on English-speaking parts of the world or, or um, channels. So I have, I have to mention some other channels that you guys mentioned in the comments. Unfortunately, they don't have English subtitles. Unlike uh, Microtech Indonesia, uh, so many Indonesian videos, but all of them have English subtitles. So I hope that the following channels will be able to, I don't know, use AI maybe to add English subtitles because we want to share your content. So uh, we have two channels from Brazil in uh, Portuguese that you guys sh showcased. It is uh, Redes Brazil and a consultant um, named Leonardo Vieira uh, from Dominando Redes. And um, they are trainers, they do all sorts of like tutorials, they interact in the comment section, they are keeping up with all the news, hardware, software, uh, back to home, all sorts of stuff. So great channels uh, if you speak Portuguese. Now, uh, on the topic of other languages, another channel that I want to plug uh, from your comments is uh, a guy called Jean-Pierre from Belgium, but uh, they speak Dutch. Uh, might be confusing for non-Europeans, but uh, Belgium is a, is a very uh, multi-languagey <laughs> territory. So yeah, this is a channel in Dutch called Wireless Info. Uh, and. Uh, I'm not sure about the content since I wasn't able to like um, fully understand what's going on, but uh, I really liked the energy of this channel. It seems easy to follow because he's doing all the uh, screen recordings step by step, commenting everything. And judging from the voice of Jean-Pierre, it feels like this channel might be one of those with a good sense of humor, but I'm not sure. So if you speak Dutch, uh, maybe you can also take a look at this channel and then come back here and in the comments tell me um, What is that channel like? But uh, I can tell you one thing that uh, uh, 
more than one uh, people recommended this channel so there you have it finally mm, there will be more um, suggestions on other youtubers from us in the next episodes uh, again in the comments let me know what I missed uh, I'm also wondering do you guys read any blogs nowadays I know that mm, we have our forums we have the reddit we have some some blogs that we've showcased in the past but um, is blogging a dying medium or not tell me in the comments show me some some articles that you enjoy about networking or microtech and uh, also i want to share with you a new um, platform that we are starting to use and um, so you know reddit and uh, you know how we moved how we are moving towards open source self-hosted stuff in the in the um, social media like uh, uh, you know microtech.social with the mastodon and blue sky integration the same movement is happening all across the board and if you don't like how Reddit does things, um, lack of transparency, ads, sometimes unnecessary censorship, all sorts of weird stuff, then you will be happy to know that there is a solution and it is called Lemmy. So check out the Microtech Lemmy space and uh, yeah, let's talk in the comments about more places where people can share um, this uh, knowledge in a you know in a democratic individually empowering ways let's move away from all this um, this algorithmic advertisement crazy space uh, we have the control we can shape the online space that we all inhabit so let's do that uh, and yeah so here are some more youtubers that you guys are watching and uh, let's meet up in the comment section and create even uh, an even bigger knowledge database of amazing microtech resources see you next time